Hey, buddy, what's up? Ultramatic64 here. Today is Friday, which means it's time for more Milo Investigations Trivlu Scootaloo. Last time we left off, I was a little lost. We found a little key thing right here, this, this blue key. And uh, we found the safe was nothing in the safe, so we're a little lost here. Uh, you guys actually said some neat stuff about... Um, Talking to some peoples, or dogs in this case. And, uh, yeah, I'm gonna do that! Alright, let's present some evidence to this guy's face. Let's present the empty safe, see what happens. What? Nothing, okay. Alright, well, let's talk to everybody and see where Opal is. Maybe they know. Probably not. Alright, where's Opal? Alright, dog. Where's Opal? I want answers! Is the pony serious? Um... Yes. Yes, I am. I have nothing to say to the pony. If you don't cooperate... He seems very dapper. Like, he seems like, I have nothing else to say to this pony. Good day to you, madam. Nothing happens, as we have the right not to talk to you. Uh, uh. Right. I was just testing you. How is it these dogs know more about the legal system than Twy? Uh. Culprits who know their rights are so infuriating. Alright. So, uh, that didn't work. So what we're gonna do now... Is I am going to head over to that spot. Because someone said, hey, X marks a spot. And I'm like, okay, fine. I saw an X over here, but nothing happened when I clicked on it, so... Let's take a closer look here. This almost looks like an X of some sort. Oh, well, there you go. It looks like we got it. Interesting. Let's combine some evidence. Uh. What? No. Not what I wanted to do. Combine with that. If X marks the spot, so to speak, and if we suppose that these claw marks indicate that whoever was here was frantically digging, then those would seem to go together. So maybe what happened was they buried the True Blue well, after they stole it down there, and they left an X to say, "Okay, this is where we got to dig to get the to get the True Blue." When we came stupid around, they were like, "Okay, we got to dig up that True Blue thing. Let's go." Namely, they indicate that whoever was digging here was expecting to find something, and in all likelihood, didn't find it. Very interesting. Or maybe not. Hmm. Too many, there's too many things. All right. I think the picture is starting to become clear to me. It is. I must confess that I do not quite know what you mean, my dear. Don't worry, Rarity. Yeah, I'm a little I confused too. I think it's just too. about time we cleared Scootaloo's name once and for all. Let's head back and have one last chat with that leader dog. Yeah, let's do it. We'll show some evidence, we'll shove some evidence in his proverbial pie hole. And then he'll be like, well, um, I can't argue with the evidence. I did it. I'm sorry. He probably won't be sorry. All right, dogs. I now know just what's going on here. And I sure hope you're ready. I certainly am. The truth is that you stole the true blue. And so there. You did it because I say so! Irrefutable evidence! The pony should present evidence. <laughs> this guy! I love this guy. <laughs> this guy. Er. Uh, huh? He must be the brains of the outfit. Like, seriously, this guy is way too smart. The pony does not even know how to present evidence. Perhaps the pony is getting ahead of herself. This guy, this guy! Can you believe this guy? I love him. <sighs> These dogs and their legal wit, where does it come from? Have they been stealing books from my library too? Yeah, you might want to check your inventory. Ahem. I am an investigator, and you will talk about last night. Uh, please? No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, why? I can't get enough of this guy. The pony is here to find a cat, not 
to talk about gems. Ah, he's, he's right. right. Um, right. But, um, surely you'd still like to, um, establish your innocence, right? <laughs> Bye. Oh, here we go! Battle the brains! We do not even know what the pony wants us to say. The pony has produced no evidence that would place us at the crime scenes. Thousands of ponies are in your little pony build. Why not them? Hmm. Let me look and see if I have any evidence to contradict that. Hmm. Ha! This proves that you did it, dogs. Well, technically it doesn't prove it, but it does prove that they were at the crime scene at least. Well, I suppose not because Spike does, you know, hang around Rarity's shop and he does eat gems, so I guess that's a okay. Okay, I see where. No, it doesn't. Yeah, I, I get, I get you, man. Uh, right. I, yeah, you're right. <laughs> Never mind. Keep it together, Twilight. Think it over before presenting. Yeah, I know. I, I shut up. No evidence. No. No. Have you given us any idea why we would steal your little gem in the first place? We have many gems here. Just a minute. Ugh. It wasn't a little gem. It was a big gem. Is the pony done talking without evidence? <sighs> they have to have had a motive to steal it. But can I prove it yet? Yeah, we've got the evidence. Please leave us be and go away. No motive. No evidence. I know that none of that is true, but what do we start with here? Hmm. We do not even know what the pony wants us to say. Let's see here. I want to look over the evidence real quick. Well... Well, he did say that dog's age. Oh, we got the chair. I forgot about that chair. Okay. The pony. Oh, whoops. Stealing Wrong button. Gems is your thing, isn't it? Confess. Wrong thing. Has some evidence. Not, not well, what I want to say. I'll get back to you on that. Is there really? Yes, no I have evidence now. Shut up, everyone. I better take another look. No. There we go. Wait a second. All right. You want evidence? I've got some evidence. The pony is becoming boring. Just ignore them, Twilight. Just ignore them. If you're done, wow, they're really getting to Twilight. I have just one important question. Do ponies have claws anywhere? Well, well, I guess no, but they could if, like, they had claw tools, I bet, with their little hooves. No. Then perhaps you might want to explain how this stool in Rarity's Boutique became ripped last night after the thief tripped over it. Oh, uh-oh, 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 smart guy here, you ain't got nothing to say to that, do ya? A creature that has claws and would want a huge sparkling gem? That seems to narrow it down a bit, don't you think? Uh... <laughs> did, did, did I get them? Not yet. Oh, for goodness sake! The pony is covering her in rather obvious other suspect! Oh, of course. It's never that easy. <laughs> I mean, like, we haven't seen Spike at all in this thing. I don't even think he's in Ponyville right now. I don't even know where he is. You mangy mongrels! Are you telling me that you're about to accuse some holy innocent pony? Accuse pony? Yes. Accuse innocent pony? No. What? But the pony will please refrain from whining all the same. <laughs> Calm down, Rarity. Let's hear it, dogs. Yeah, what do you mean? I I'm... can't say I like where this is going. I don't understand how they can dispute that evidence. I mean, that's that's a big blow right there. Now's no time to lose your head, though, Twilight. Let's hear what they've got to say. Please, the pony is obviously covering for someone who she doesn't want anyone to suspect here. We refer, of course, to your little dragon friend. 
Yeah, oh, see, they've been, they know what I've been knowing all along. <laughs> he has claws and a healthy appetite for chips. Oh, look, smart guy over home. here. What happened? Here's what happened. Your little dragon friend broke the window to your pony's house, then jumped in. He's not the brightest, so of course he wouldn't have cared about the noise. Well, I don't know. Spike's a pretty bright guy. Let me look and see if some evidence might not back that up. Well, I don't feel like presenting that because I don't think that'll hold up. What's inside? He found the gem and made off with it like the dirty little thief he is. Uh huh. Hmm. You already know he has rampage and greedy little episodes. Gems stolen, houses destroyed. This is no different from that. Okay, no, no, I'm very confused. They know about, um... Oh, what's the dang name of the episode? Uh, Secret to my excess. So they know about that. So then this, this takes place... Uh, continuity hurts my head. Oh, gosh. Alright. Fine! Fine! I don't, I don't even care. I believe the pony is now aware of just how off base she really is. Now go away! Dragon friend? I can't believe they'd bring up Spike. Yeah. Ugh, this is absurd. But he does have claws. Yeah. And he did have that massive surge of greed. Yeah. And he does like gems. Don't forget that. No, 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 Twilight. Of course he didn't do it. But how do I prove that? Shows he couldn't be the culprit. Think Twilight. Think Spike's depending on you. Wait, the pony is obviously covering for. Let me look over the evidence again. Let's see here. No, 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 no. Hmm. Mm. Hmm. No, that wouldn't work right now, at least. He has claws and a healthy appetite for gems. Gems just like the one pilfered from your prissy pony. What happened? Here's what happened. Your little dragon friend broke the window to your pony's house, then jumped in. He's not the brightest, so of course he wouldn't have cared about the noise. Well, we know that's not the case, but... Oh, wait, 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 hang on. Hang on, can we show that Rarity's door was open? Because it was. Or, well, that would matter. Ugh. Think, 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 think. Where am I missing a connection here? I'm missing something. I guess it's just a minute. Broke it with what? True. Who cares? His fists? His head? It is rock hard after all. It doesn't need to house a brain. That's 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 really mean. Uh, I don't know if there's anything here. Can I prove that Spike couldn't have broken the window? Yes, actually we can. He found the gem and made off with it like the dirty little thief he is. Well, we can. But this will this will show that Scootaloo did it. So then they'll just finger Scootaloo. Oh, why not? Let's. Hmm. I don't. No, that's this not right. This that Spike couldn't have been the culprit. What? How? Uh, well, I okay, don't fine. Know. Don't be that way. I'm not trying to guess. Money. What happened? What? It? Found the gem, meow. Yeah. Let's see if she says. They got me. They've got me in a 
stranglehold here. Hang on, wait, 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 wait. Hang on, do we have a... Darn, we don't have a profile for Spike. I was gonna say, maybe he's not in Ponyville at all. So therefore we can say, no. <laughs> You're wrong. There's gotta be something that shows that Spike wasn't there. This episode's gonna take a while. I can't find any evidence about it. Let me go back through. He has it. What happened? Here's what happened. Your little dragon friend broke the window to your pony's house, then jumped in. He's not the brightest, so of course he wouldn't have cared about the noise. It's right here. We have to figure out how to prove that Spike didn't break the window. What are these used for? They're used for tools. But for what? Ugh. There's too many connections and I can't find the right one. Definitely not different, but it is kind of different at the same time. I believe the pony is now aware of just how off base she really is. Now go away! I'm thinking of presenting the hairs, but I don't think the hairs have anything to do with what we're talking about right now. Wait, hang on! Hang on a minute, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, Let's try presenting this. Hmm. This proves that. No, but that. They have gems in their pockets! <laughs> ah. This is one reason I don't. This is one thing I don't like about these games is that you have to know, like, how the game is gonna work to get things to work right, and. What? I'm not good at that. <laughs> I don't see how the tools would work here. Uh, I'm missing something. Hmm. This nope. What's inside? Darn it. Ah, there's nothing here that makes sense to me! There's gotta be something. I'm just not getting it. I 
That doesn't have anything to do with the case. I mean, it, it would if we could... That was my timer that says we're out of time, but I'm not gonna quit because I want to know. So, here's the thing. If this would say that tire tracks that swerved into the window, then we could be like, yeah, here, this evidence shows that the dragon could not have busted through the window because he does not make tire tracks unless he's a tank, in which case we have bigger problems than that. But we can't because it doesn't work that way. Oh, there's got to be something here that I'm just not, I'm overlooking something. All right, here, we don't get penalized for pressing them for more info, so you know what? We're gonna press them for as much info as we can get. Just a minute. That, that doesn't mean anything. What evidence do you have that he did it? About as much as you have that we did it, Pony. It's quite simple. What happened? Here's what happened. Your little dragon friend. Just a minute. Broke it with what? Okay, we already okay. saw that bit. Okay, we already saw that bit. Just a minute. Wait, how in Equestria do you even know about that? A gigantic dragon demolishing an entire town that we live next to. How does the pony think we not know about it? Yeah, that I kind of figured well, that, but... then how can you say this is no different if you know so much about that, then? I don't think the town got destroyed this time. Has your little dragon friend experienced any sudden growth spurts lately? No, but... So this does take place somewhere in Season 3. Then he did what he could with his tiny little dragon body. That's a story! Ugh. My Celestia's name. This dog is annoying. This can't be right. Besides scale, was there really nothing else different? Gems stolen, houses destroyed. Wait. Gems. As in every gem? Hmm. I believe the pony is now aware of just how off base she really Every gem, so... Wait a second. Let's try this. This is no different from Spike's ring. Here we go. Huh. See, I knew we had to put the gems somewhere. I was just like, I don't know where to put them. Now? What? No! No! It was no different than that stupid little dragon, stupid little opers! No different at all? No! Not one bit! Really? Then, would you care to explain one little thing? Ah, uh, what? Why was the true blue the only thing that was stolen? Mm-hmm! What is the pony on about now? Well, think about it, man. Spike was on a rampage. When Spike was all Spike want! He stole everything! Yep, there you except. go. It didn't matter what it was. He wanted it. But, in this case, nothing was stolen but the true blue. Not even these gems that had been on the ripped stool and which would have been in plain sight. If Spike was our thief here, explain that. Why don't you? What? I, 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 I don't know! Yeah, yeah, you don't know! For one for Twilight. Yeah, after like five, after five like tries, yeah, we got, we got one try. We got one point, man. Mm -hmm. The pony is forgetting. Uh oh, smart guy got something. Ugh, forgetting what? The broken window. Um, come again? I don't, I like, don't where like where this, this is going. going. The only evidence the pony has that there even was a break in is the broken window. Your precious little suspect is the one who broke that window, of course. The pony accuses us of breaking in but ignores the guilt of the only pony who could have been her culprit. If we stole from your precious prissy pony, then we would have needed to enter her house. But we did not. The pony has nothing to even show how we could enter. Aha! Uh -huh! Today, your prissy pony... Nope, nope, I got something! Actually, she doesn't keep her door... She didn't keep her door locked then. Can we present that? Blah, blah, blah. 
No. Okay, so nothing there. We could present the tools, because the tools look like lockpicking tools. Like, that, the purple jib looks like a, like, hooked, so you could pick a lock with that. Or, no, the keys, no, no, the key wouldn't, would the key work? Uh, well, let's try doing this. That's a very interesting thing to know, I have to say. What? That Rarity keeps her doors locked. Yeah, you gotta Other be casing the joint to know that. Useful, but I can't see how that information would help anything. Not unless you intended to do something with it. Stop beating around the bush, pony. Rarity, this hooked gem fragment. You've never seen it before, right? Why, no, darling. It's certainly not mine. I would never have a purpose for such an ill-shaped gemstone as that. Which means mm -hmm. this was left here by the culprit. Or should I say culprit? Here this we go! This carved piece of gemstone clearly only has one purpose. It picks locks. And where did it come from? Well, I've only seen one other example of carved gemstones like this. Oh man, we gotta pick this one or this one. Carved from a gem. Let's try this one. How thick? Namely, right here. You dogs carved that furniture and those keys, and you carved this lockpick too. Then in your haste to leave, you dropped it for us to find, which was your critical mistake. Tell me, dogs, if our perpetrator came in by breaking the window, what could this be for? Gah! Oh, and look at that! What a hit! We win! Yeah! We had one life point left! Ah, oh, in your face, dog. I am the smarterest person's ever. How did you know that Rarity kept her door locked? How did you know that Scootaloo had been there? The answer is simple. You were there. You stole the true blue! Well, um... Yeah, yeah, what do you, you got? You got nothing to say to that, huh? I've got one this time. So fast. Ah, no, not so fast, guy. Or not. You presented a nice story, pony, but nice stories do not implicate dogs. Maybe we did make a hooked gem fragment. Maybe it was stolen from us. Does the pony have evidence? Fair to enough. Use that for what she says. Fair enough. That it, that is a. I mean, granted, it's silly, but yeah, that that is a thing that can happen. Besides, you, Pony, have been ignoring a critical part of any case. Here come our favorite legal eagles again. Or in this case, legal dogs. It's simple. We have no motive. G what? You have no motive to steal a gigantic gem? <laughs> Let me explain for the slow ponies here. Namely me, he's talking to me. Uh oh. Double fighting sequence. Oh dear. Well, he does have a point there. We've got so many gems that, as you so helpfully pointed out, we make our furniture from gems. Alright. So what if your little gem is huge? We've got other huge gems lying around. You can have your stupid gem. A gem that large couldn't even be carved properly anyway. This is it, Twilight. All you have to do is prove a motive, and you've got this in the bag. Well, what if we present the empty safe? I mean, a safe would be, well, granted, like, gems would probably be about as valuable as rocks here. And so, there wouldn't be any reason to have them in a safe. However, I don't know, that, that makes me think that maybe they keep some for trade or something like that, right? Cause they gotta make, they gotta get food and whatnot somehow, unless they hunt and forage, in which case that falls apart. Can't let up now. In case the pony hadn't noticed, we'll have gems coming out of our ears in these caves. 
Just a minute. You expect me to believe that? I mean, I don't see any gems, though. You don't even have any gems in your ears at all. Well, that's not what I was going for, Twilight, but okay. Hermes do not understand figures of speech. I did not know they were that dense. That's not what I meant, man. Uh, the, the problem is he's not... I don't see a ton of gems on the floors and whatnot. You'd think if they were coming out of their ears, as they so claim, that they would have so many gems that they'd be on the floors and whatnot, and they'd be, you know, a vast, a lot of gems, basically. So, makes no sense. I think we need to present the open safe. You don't have any gems lying around. Obviously, we don't have them lying around. Have a little sense, Powell. If we left our huge gems just sitting around in our caves, then a green little dog could... Ah, never mind. That's not the important part. Oh, here we go! What? Here we go! I like he was about to say something, but then he stopped. Curious. The point, Powell, is this. There's no reason why we'd mod it more than any other gem. We we'll have no attachment to it. We've never even seen it before. All right, let me look over the evidence real quick. Okay, so what we can do? I think we should present this because the uh, if they have so many gems and if. Okay, they don't want dog, other dogs, which I didn't know there were other diamond dogs, I guess, over here in this area. So, if they did have other dogs out here, then they want to keep it in the safe, right? So, therefore, with the safe being empty, they have no gems. So, therefore, they're contradicting their own statement saying that they do have more, a ton of gems lying around. Okay? Alright, alright. So, let's... Nope. Of course you had a motive. This proves it. That proves nothing, Powell. Yeah. But how does uh, it not prove anything? Right. It contradicts uh, your statements. Twilight, look before you leave. I was looking before I leaped. You didn't understand my brain logic. We've got other huge gems lying around. It's right here. We have to figure out what to say right here that would make it... Hang on, can I present evidence, um, when he's talking? I think maybe there was another dog here. Which indicates the empty room, which would show that, okay, there's another dog around here that knows our caverns and knows where our gems are, so therefore we should, you know, hide all our gems or something. I don't know. Uh... Let me try... Hmm. No, that's I... not right. There's... Just a minute. No attachment to it. Nothing at all? Not even to an enormous gem? No! The probably will not make us repeat ourselves again! Why does this bother me? And what was he about to say before he stopped himself? I can't help but feel like that's a final importance. Yeah, I know, but I'm trying to figure out what evidence to show that would... <sighs> Maybe I should ask him again. Yeah. This is it, Twilight. All you have... Can't let up now! If we have to ask him again, but how? How do we go about doing it right?
No, they that profile has nothing to do with anything. Let me read over this again. Just a minute. Other huge gems, huh? Where are these? Oh. Then a greedy dog. A greedy little dog at that. But no way, he had the key the if we're talking about literally the little dog, then he had the key to the safe. So therefore he'd have access to the gems at all times. So therefore he can be trusted. Ah, uh, there's gotta be something I'm missing here. Ah, never mind. That's not the Could I'm thinking maybe the key. Hmm. No. Of course. Ugh. Maybe the... Well, no. I was gonna say maybe the white here is actually a dog's. Like, a, a different dog that we don't know about. But I don't have any evidence that supports that theory. There's got to be something I'm missing here. Oh, I hate this because I'm trying to make connections, but nothing's connecting in my head. There's gotta be something I'm missing here. Dogs with... I know this rock has nothing to do with anything, but I'm gonna try it. Nope. Okay, we're done. I think that's just about enough out of you, Pony. It's obvious that you have no idea what you're talking about. No, I don't, because I, I never know what I'm talking about, man. What are you, are you crazy? No, that's Pony. My patience has run out! Did I remind you that you are not here to investigate gems? This is preposterous! What of the fact that she's eliminated the possibility of both Spiky Wacky and dear Scott Lewis culprits? Who else does that leave? Who cares? She hasn't established who is the culprit! And that's what's important! And I think the portal has been given quite long enough to do that by now! Ugh! No, we weren't. We were way off. No, I've come this far. I can see it through to the end. I just need to think things over. There's something I've missed. I just yeah, know I know. Oh, sweet. We don't have to start that. Okay, that's nice. We'll have gems coming out of our ears in these cards. Okay. He has a point. They do have gems, but there's got to be something I'm missing. Well, we've got so many gems that, as you so helpfully pointed out, so. Just a minute. Whoops. Other... Well, let's try this. I know it's not going to work, mm. but let's try it. Up. Nope. Hmm. Hmm. 
There's gotta be something I'm missing here. Can you try presenting these again? No? There's no There's gotta be something missing here. Hmm. Nope. Just a minute. Other few Wrong thing. I'm missing something, and I just can't figure out what. I'm trying to run through everything in my head, but I'm not figuring anything out. More important, I'm wasting time. Let me try presenting the red key. Hmm. No. Uh, no. No. I've come this far. I... There's got to be something I'm not getting here. I mean, what he's basically saying is they don't want their gems lying around, so therefore you put him in a safe, right? Or in that giant room. But we've tried both those, and it didn't work. could easily invent a way to do so. I will come in here anytime soon. Why would you even say that, Twilight? It's not even relevant. Um, no. The crap is the Ugh. Rude, Rude much? much? Although... Yeah. Come to think of it, wouldn't larger gems be Easier to cut, more to work with. The problem is testing my patience. Move the gems to us, and whatever it is you do to you. Oddly defensive there, Mr. Dog. This is it, Twilight. Camp! Motive. Motive, 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 motive. I don't see a motive. I don't know. I, I can't piece it together. What I'm questioning is their their safe is empty, so therefore they must be out of gems, right? And they're frantic. They I don't know what this hole is. I think this is where they buried True Blue, so that's why that's there. But back to the safe. I don't know. I feel like the the safe has some sort of importance here. I just can't piece it together in my head where this goes. I hate this because it's like a big jigsaw puzzle and I just can't figure out where all the pieces go. It's like one of those confusing jigsaw puzzles where the pieces completely change and you just can't ever figure it out. Okay. No. No. No, 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 nothing here. We've got so many gems that, as you so helpfully pointed out, we make our furniture from gems! Let me try presenting this key to them and maybe... But they don't! They don't have huge gems! I don't know how to prove that! Oh, this is so... Ugh, there's gotta be something I'm missing! It's bugging me. It's This is really starting to bug me. Like, I'm trying to figure this out, and it's just... There's nothing in my head is connecting. Ugh! 
Not only that, but this is taking forever. Motive, 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 motive. Ugh. What is the what motive would they have? Okay, these two pieces of evidence have nothing to do with anything. Like, the, this is nothing to do with anything. Neither is this. Okay, so let me get rid of those. Ugh. There's gotta be something here. Something, anything. I can't for the life of me figure this out. Alright. I think what I'm gonna do is this. I'm gonna think this over for about a week and then come back to you guys on this. Cause at this point this we could go around in this for circles and and for days and just have nothing. So instead of me just guessing around here and trying to figure it out, I'm gonna you know, call it a day today, and, you know, think about this. You know, sleep on it, I guess would be a better term to use. Uh, if you guys do want to leave any help in the comments, uh, yeah, go ahead and do that. But, uh, yeah, please don't, like, give me the, like, this is exactly what you have to do. You know, give me a little bit of ambiguity here. Like, like give me a little, like, give me hints, but don't tell me outright what to do. Because I like to figure things out on my own. You know, I'm, I'm that kind of guy. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of My Little Investigations, True Blue, Scootaloo. Yeah, we're a little bit of a sticky wicket here. And I know I'm not the brightest bulb in the neon display. If... No, wait, they don't have neon. They don't have bulbs in neon displays, do they? I'm not the most fluorescent of neons. There you go. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you have a fantastic day. I'm Ultramag64. Remember, don't feel those bear sprites. And as always, happy gaming. I'll check the answers and bye! Bye. <laughs>